Section Zero of Between the Lines. This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information or to volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. Between the Lines by Boyd Cable, Section Zero. To the editor of the Corn Hill, Reginald John Smith, for whose helpful criticism and advice. Kindly consideration and unfailing courtesy to an unknown writer, a sufficiency of grateful appreciation can never be expressed by the author. Forward. This book, all of which has been written at the front within sound of the German guns, and for the most part within shell and rifle range, is an attempt to tell something of the manner of struggle that has gone on for months between the lines along the western front and more especially of what lies behind and goes to the making of those curt and vague terms in the war communiques. I think that our people at home will be glad to know more, and ought to know more, of what these bald phrases may actually signify, when, in the other sense, we read between the lines. Of the people at home, whom we at the front have relied upon and looked to more than they may know, Many have helped us in heaping measure of deed and thought and thoughtfulness, while others may perhaps have failed somewhat in their full duty, because, as we have been told and retold to the point of weariness, they, quote, have not understood, and, quote, do not realize, and, quote, were never told. If this book brings anything of interest and pleasure to the first, and of understanding to the second, it will very fully have served its double purpose. Boyd Cable, Somewhere in France, September 15th, 1915 End of Section Zero